Well, it's one of the biggest rivalries of the HBO PSL, and tonight we saw Lahore Kalandis take down the Karachi Kings, unfortunately, at their home ground. Nick Knight, you had the pleasure of calling this game from the commentary box. What did you make of it? I thought it was a terrific game of cricket. I mean, you rightly say all the rivalry that's there, so that'll add nerves and pressure and expectation. I thought they bowled really well. Uh, the Kalandas, I mean, obviously Fakas a man's going to get a lot of credit for the way he played and the 100 he scored, but I actually thought probably the game was won with the ball because I thought Karachi Kings were under par. It wasn't that under, but I thought probably 180 plus was more a realistic target. Harris Ralph had a brilliant uh, game as well, coming back from leaking those runs in the last over of the last game. So I thought it was, I thought it was a great game from the bowlers and finished off by the batters. But of course, Fak is a man's innings. It's one of the better innings I've seen in this format of the game for sure. And how cool Karma collected was it? You almost didn't realise he got an 100. I know. I, I mean, when most of us get a 100, we go so kind of mad and silly and do all sorts <laughs> of funny things. He just went like that. Yeah, thank you very much. I, I think part of the reason was Again, you know the expectation of this, uh, of this, the result. They need the points, and he still had work to do. And I like that about players. I like that about Fakir Zaman because it wasn't the personal performance. Yeah, sure, he was brimful of, of happiness, and it was a great performance. But he still knows those two points. And I, and I thought actually when Hafiz got out, and I was calling it at the time, I thought the game was pretty much on a knife edge. For all I say there about them, you know, being a bit under par, Karachi, I thought the game was pretty even at that point. And he, Fakir Zaman, had to say, right, I've still got to finish the job. And he did it really well. In terms of what the Karachi Kings can take out of this as a positive is, you know, they managed to scrap together a decent total, like you said, and it was about Baba Azam really making an impact for the third game in a row. So he really needs to get firing, you'd think, in order to give them a chance. Yeah, I feel a bit for him and for Karachi, actually, because he's such a good player. Uh, he's just a, he's a touch player. He's not a belligerent player. He's not a muscly player who whacks him over the boundary edge, he's a touch player, he's a class player, he's a crafty player, and he's just a little short of his best touch, he's a little out of touch at the moment, and that's just affecting him a little bit. Um, they're trying to work around it a bit, Shazil does what Shazil does, and they put in Nabi at three today, which was interesting, almost trying to cover that a little bit, but there's no, there's no way around it. He will find his best touch. I mean, he's a class player, one of the best players in the world. It's just affecting them a little bit at the moment. My overall assessment of the Merrin is that I just feel they need to be a bit more fearless, a little bit more fearless all round, and I think they'll start to get back in winning ways. And talking about winning ways, we just had a win for the new captain, Shane Shafridi. He's won one and nil now, so you know, not a bad start to his campaign as, as a uh, you know, captain, I suppose. But how do you feel about bowlers as captains for one, and how do you think he's going? We had that debate up there, actually. <laughs> actually, I think it was in the studio at the start. Sikander said to me, he said, what about batters? Of course we batters, isn't it? I mean, bowlers, really, honestly? But, uh, I mean, we're joking here. But uh, I think he's done really well, actually. Uh, the most important thing for me when I watch him in the field as a captain, it hasn't affected his bowling. You know, he's a world-class bowler, one of the best bowlers in the world. What you don't want to see when you give someone the captaincy is that sort of burden, that expectation, and just and perhaps not quite performing as you'd like. Because the best thing he can do, captaincy or not captaincy, is bowl like he's bowling. So I like that. That doesn't seem to have affected him. He's made some good decisions. He's got some, some senior players around him, and, and that's what he will hold on to at the moment. So all, all things looking pretty good. I mean, he really perhaps should have won the first game as well. So at least he's got two points. Well, fantastic from the Lahore Kalandas. They did down their arch nemesis, the Karachi Kings tonight, and what a fantastic game it was.